Okay, let's go. Let's try this again. How we can we can slow down time. I can't imagine that that's where the mechanic is, though, right? He's just missing us now, like that. Jason Hakai, what does this give us? Any information? Not really. Doesn't give us nothing. It won't let me lock on at all. It won't let me, like, latch onto him and jump to him. He just dodges. I can move while he's watching. Go wait for the right moment and hit him hard. Which is when exactly, Luffy? He dodged that too. the perfectly timed guard thing, I guess. Yeah, I'm not sure that, yeah, it just does, it just cancels it out when you get close. There's got to be something that I'm completely missing here. don't understand this offers me no in no information see it doesn't I don't know what to do. Because it wouldn't... You wouldn't have to have a certain skill, would you? Because that would be awful game design. Because what if you just didn't get that skill? So it has to be normal combat related. Hmm... So what do we do? There's nowhere else to hook on. Um, is there anywhere else to hook on? Like, no, not really. This seems to be quicker. Ow. It just loads us into this mode, like, perhaps for some reason. Oh fuck, I'm awful. I wish there was a fucking lock on. Like a decent one. I can't move what make a move while he's watching. Go for the right moment and hit him hard. Okay, almost there. There's another robot here. Why is there a different robot here? <laughs> we did we did something there. Was that robot important? What if I didn't have that dodge move though? Right? Like that makes me feel like that's what well, it shouldn't be that. Uh, 
out. Grazed him. I mean, that's great and all, but. <laughs> to swap to get rid of these fucking robots efficiently. So you do have to, you do have to do this to do it. That doesn't make any fucking sense because what if you didn't get that skill? Or did you have, or do you have that one by default? Maybe you had that one by default. I guess you must, right? Otherwise it'd be fucking stupid. <laughs> Fucking robot ads. You guys, you coming for me or not? I can't even hit this fucking guy now. Okay. Oh, I see. I had to just press a button. Ugh. Isaac, you you able to continue like this? Straw hat. You're just a pirate. Why are you even helping her? She wants to save you. That's the only reason I need. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. She wants to save me. I just want to... I see what's going on here. You didn't tell her about your brother. About what happened to Ace. You're trying to... Try to vicariously redeem your failure through Janine and myself. <laughs> you wish to help me? How are you supposed to help me when you can't even help yourself? You can help me by disappearing from my sight. You're really getting on my nerves. Both you and Janine are alive. And you'll always be running because of what you lost. Janine is much stronger than you than the likes of you. You're afraid of her. The look yourself uh, you lock yourself up in robotic armor because you can't look her in the eyes. How dare you? A bloody pirate. You know nothing. Oh, so now he's got even bigger robot arms. I'm assuming this one's not as fast, and I can actually hit this one. We just like elephant gun, just right on top of him. Let's see how much that does. Oh, <laughs> Isaac, Izzy boy, <laughs> you got obliterated. Holy shit!
Is that really it? That was a really disappointing last fight. Hey, Mama's a straw hat too. This is what that mom looks like, huh? あなたが守るべきものはそこにさあ、目をそらさず見てみなさい。母さん。母さん。兄さん。兄さん。ジョニー。兄さん。空中監獄が私は母さんが守ったものを守りたい。兄さんと一緒にだからいいさ。いい加減力を貸して。兄さん。何がそんなにおかしいのよ。こんな大変な時に。麦わらのルフィ。用事は済んだろう。<笑><笑><笑> そろそろお前たちの船が来ている。お前はどうするんだ。ダイナガンを世界政府に渡すことはできない。このまま空中監獄ごと爆破する。もう少し島から距離を稼ぎたいのに。予定外の戦闘で水力が落ちている。対三対
This is where their entire budget went onto this cutscene. Like, it's an explosion off the coast. Would that not have caused, like, <laughs> maybe we're looking into it too hard, but would that not have caused, like, a tsunami just wiping out this island? Oh, up they go. <laughs> They're like, peace out, Luby, we leave in. Ah, we did it. Done. Ah. Oh, I can't believe we finished it. Look at that. That was... That was good. Man. Oh boy, I can't really explain... <laughs> my feelings on this game. Uh, it's difficult. Um, so... Uh, you guys won't see this for a couple of days yet. Uh, but I also finished recording uh, Left and Live, and uh, my feelings were a lot more clear cut on uh, the ending of that game. Uh, both of these games have ended around the same time, which doesn't usually happen. Usually we finish one game and we start another game, and about halfway through that game, the other series finishes. But both of these series has finished at the same time, which is, uh, which is kind of, a little bit kind of rough. Uh, but, but let's let's talk about this. Let's talk about One Piece, World Seeker, as a whole. Uh, I really enjoyed this game. I really enjoyed it. There, there is problems. Like, <laughs> believe me, there is problems. Uh, you know, there's the whole, like, snipers knocking you out everywhere and, and stuff like that. Uh, not being able to hit people when you've knocked them down, like, that sort of stuff. And it is a little clunky in area to area. The quest system, the side quests, and, like, just general quest system in its entirety is from a PS3 game or something. You know, it's very old-fashioned. Uh, but... I enjoyed it. I enjoyed this so over overall. I think it looks pretty enough. Uh, it's fun just to be 
Luffy and running around uh, an environment, a, pr a nice, gorgeous environment, you know, cartoony and stuff. It's very good. Uh, the, I feel like some of the things in this game was missing, other characters. And I realize most people are probably going to play Luffy anyway, right? Like, he's the main character. That's who they're all going to probably play. But, like, imagine a Naruto Ninja Storm game where you could only play Naruto. You know, there was no playing as Sasuke or Sakura or Kakashi or Gara. You know, like, none of those none of those were playable, you know? Like, maybe the comparison's not quite the same because that's a fighting game and this is more of an adventure game. Uh, but, like, would, it would be very cool. Like, the point where... Um, the point where Luffy ran off, it could have been a fight with Sabo and the Magma guy, right? Like, you could have played Sabo for a little while, just for that fight or something like that. And I realize that's a lot of money, which they probably didn't have, because I don't believe these One Piece games get a whole lot of money to, like, be made. You know, I think they are working on a very strict budget. So... Uh, I guess that's probably where that comes from. I suppose that comes from where all the voice acting or lack of voice acting comes from as well. The, the very strict budget. But I would like to see more voice acting. I'd love to see English voice acting in a future One Piece game. But uh, maybe <laughs> maybe I'm asking too much. Uh, but, you know, more voice acting, more generalized cutscenes. There wasn't enough cutscenes in it. Not just pretty cutscenes or stuff like that, but just talking to people could be voiced, stuff like that, uh, instead of it all just being text. It just feels, it just feels lazy in the long run, and you know, all you get is that, Liffy, Liffy, every single time you talk to somebody, and it's annoying. Uh, definitely more characters, I would love to have played as all of the Straw Hat Pirates at some points, even if it's just for various side quests, or if I, if I can just switch out and play as whoever I want, whenever I want, through the entire game. You know, either way, I think it would be good. I do realize that Luffy is probably the most important character to make sure he's in there and works. Because he's the he's the protagonist, right? He's the main character. Uh, but it would be nice to be able to play the other people, at least from time to time. Uh, the combat, very basic, but I quite like it. Um... It's simple, doesn't get overly complicated, uh, but at the same time, it uh, never gets really too hard. Uh, the final boss was a complete joke. <laughs> that was really disappointing, wasn't it? We just completely obliterated him with the elephant gun. gun, gun. Uh, there was a bit of a difficulty spike, but uh, just leveling up a couple of skills seemed to make all the difference, like strength and defense-wise. So, and it, it, not necessarily we had to do that either. I don't think we had to go and grind at all. I just chose to grind uh, to make it easier on myself rather than uh, trying to get through with the skills that I, uh, that I currently had. Um, but, yeah, the story is fine. Uh, it, if not a bit uh, boring in places, and the side quest where Janine just constantly pops up in every different location is kind of weird. Uh, but, but yeah, that's fine. Uh, the original characters for this game, Janine is kind of boring. She's not very interesting. Isaac is kind of boring too. Uh, although Isaac looks cooler, like he has a much better design, uh, than Janine. Although I do like Janine's boots. She's got really good boots. Um, every member of the Straw Hat Pirates is obviously here, and they, they're all good, but... You, you, you don't really interact with them enough. Uh, the karma system could use some work. The crafting system could use some work. Gathering materials could do some use of some work. Uh, the game the, is very... I think looking at the game objectively rather than... Because uh, I, like I said, I, I really enjoyed the game. Overall, I really enjoyed myself. If I was judging it on that, I would say like, oh yeah, it's totally like, a, like an 8, you know? But it, it's not. Like objectively... I think it is a five. It's, and I don't like. I don't really like giving numerical values to a complex opinion, but uh, I think it is very average. It's very middle of the road sort of game. If you look at all of the aspects, it's very, very, very average. Uh, but uh, if you like One Piece, I think you like it. It's definitely the best One Piece game. There you go. Uh, except from the Pirate Warriors. Uh, Pirate Warriors free specifically. Is it free? Did the Pirate Warriors get free games? 
I feel like they did, actually, now that I'm, now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, whatever the Pirate Warrior game was, that's really good. <laughs> that's really fun. The Dynasty Warriors Pirate Warrior game is great. Uh, but... Uh, but this is the best adventure game. And it's probably one of the best adventure anime games that I've played, actually. Um, I don't... I'm, not, I'm trying to think of other things. They've mostly been, like, Dynasty Warrior games, right? Like, Bleach had that Soul Resurrection, but that was more of a Dynasty Warrior game. But that was quite good. Um, so see, Dynasty Warriors is just such an easy... Uh, it's such an easy thing to annotate to your animes, I guess. Like, there's a Berserk one, isn't there? There's a Fate one, uh, which apparently is pretty good. Uh, there's the Gundam ones, which are awesome, and then there's the, uh, One Piece ones, which are good. Uh, Naruto hasn't got one yet, so, you know, maybe we'll get a Naruto Warriors? <laughs> that would be pretty weird, though, right? I don't think you, there's many opportunities for that to happen in the game. Maybe that's why we haven't got one of them. One of them. Um, but then again, there really wasn't many opportunities for Bleach, either, and they shoehorned that shit in, so, <laughs> who knows? Um... And uh, the, there's not many One Piece fighting games either, though, right? Like, there's a couple, but there's not as many as like the Naruto fighting games. So, the, I guess it's just where, how it lends itself to it. But I would like to see more anime adventure games. I'd like to see a Naruto adventure game, like very much in this regard. But I get to run around the Hidden Leaf Village and uh, outside of that village and over the like their ninja world. Like that would be really fun doing quests and stuff as Naruto or. Or other characters, if you'd like to, as well. Like, that would be really fun. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure there's anything else for me to say. Uh, the soundtrack in this game uh, was very good. Not very good soundtrack. Which is a shame. I, I don't think it used sounds from the game. Although, I can't hear it quite as well as uh, probably what you guys can. Or what you guys should be hearing it as, should I say. Uh, just because... Like, right now, the sound tr sounds actually very, very quiet. That's not the... That is just the game. It's just very, very quiet. Uh, but, yeah, I don't know. It just wasn't as exciting. Like, the the One Piece anime has great sounds and great music. And this has some of the sound effects, but the music itself is not quite there. And I think that kind of happens in a lot of these sort of games. You know, it happens in movies, too. Like, um... Uh, I'm trying to think of a example of recently, but I don't really watch many uh, anime movies. Um, so, like, the Dragon Ball Z movies, for example, the music and the sound is just not quite as good as it is on the show. Like, the actual sound, it, not like the, say the sound, because you'd be able to afford, like, bigger sound effects, but the actual, like, songs themselves are not quite as good. Like, I don't know why, if they've, like, not allowed to use it for some weird copyright reason or not i don't know uh we won we got a tro gold trophy for that too it's nice like this is probably the best track in the uh, <laughs> in the game but it, it is a very quiet game in comparison There you go, One Piece, One Piece World Seeker. We fucking did it, guys. We beat it. We beat the game. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, if you did, uh, let me know. Let me know if you enjoyed this all the way through. If you watched all the way through, you're a fantastic person. Thank you so much. And I'll see you all on our next adventure. Which I have no idea what it's going to be. I've got to figure out two series now. Oh, might, be a, might be time to finally return to... Uh, City Skylines or something. Man, not played that in a while. And that new industry pack came out. Not played it yet. Uh, anyway, I'm babbling at this point. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.